Hey guys, how's it going? It's Hayden with MyEyeBroke.com. We we're going to do an iPhone 4 ear speaker replacement today. We got a customer's phone in here. We're having a hard time diagnosing it. So we're going to take this opportunity to turn it into a tutorial for you guys. So let's start off. We've already got it going a little bit. You're going to want to remove the two bottom screws with your pencil lobe or your Phillips head screwdriver. And then you slide the uh, back cover towards the top of the phone um, and the cover will slide right off like it were the back of a remote. Um, then you're going to take uh, and remove the battery connector screw here after which you're going to use your non-conductive prying tool and gently pry up the battery connector. One of the most common problems that uh, people run into when doing their own repairs on the iPhone 4 is ripping this battery connector off of the motherboard. Uh, we are able to repair that for you. If that does happen, you can visit our website, myeyebroke.com, for that. All right, so let's pry out the battery gently. As you can see, we've already ripped the plastic um, for the battery, so you're going to want to make sure that... Uh, you try not to rip that plastic. Um, when we when we run into this problem, we just simply replace it so everything is original when we send the phones back. Um, there's some adhesive here on the side of the phone. You can you can stick that plastic down so it doesn't keep flopping up on you. All right, ear speaker replacement. First thing after removing the battery is remove the antenna cover here. Okay. Now we're gonna move remove the motherboard. We're gonna start off by removing the antenna cable that's always one of the first things you want to do so you don't forget and then you're going to you're going to want to remove the sim card a pentalobe screwdriver or a uh, paper clip will help you get that that sim card tray out all right next step you're going to remove the metal cover over the dock connecting flex uh, you're going to remove the two screws that hold that cover down uh, they are different sizes so Make sure you keep them separated. Okay. All right. Next thing you're going to do is gently pry up the. You're going to remove this. Gently pry up the flex connector. Be careful. It's very fragile. Um, you don't want this to break off. Okay. All right. That's pretty simple there. Uh, your next step is going to be to remove this screw here at the base of the motherboard at the top of the speaker assembly. We're going to remove the speaker assembly just for safety's sake. So you're going to undo the screw here on this end and just kind of grab it, just pinch it and gently pull it up. It'll come right out. Uh, the top of this speaker assembly has a magnet on it. So you can um, use that to keep track of this other screw here. You can just kind of put it on top and it'll stick right on top. All right, the next thing we're going to do is we're going to remove this screw here, the water sensor. You're going to want to preserve that water sensor, so just scrape it off with one of your flat tools. If it's the phone's been wet, it'll show the red on the back side. If, it's, if it hasn't been wet, it will um, usually stay white. All right. Set that off to the side and make sure you put this screw back with it. This screw right here. Sometimes it doesn't want to pry out. There you go. All right. There are five screws on this cover. We've already got one of them removed because we've been tinkering around on this phone. Uh, this screw does tend to be difficult at times. Uh, sometimes the little piece that the screw fits into behind it will break off. If that does happen, it's not the end of the world. All right, so you're going to remove these five screws. This flex plate is clipped in right here with two little hooks. So you just want to get underneath of it. Sometimes the screws will pop. 
and just kind of work it out as we've said in the previous videos everything with this phone is designed to fit perfectly so if you have to force it you're doing something wrong just take your time move slow and you'll be fine if you'll notice these uh, clips here they hook into the frame for that and you want to keep these screws together okay all right all five of those screws are different sizes so make sure you lay them out in a way um, that you can tell them apart I'm going to zoom in for you guys a little bit so we can get a closer look. Um, we're not going to need to remove the vibrate motor. Um, so we're just going to remove one more screw. This top screw here. This screw actually has another screw that screws into the top of it for that flex plate. So keep that with your flex plate. Now you're going to want to gently pry up these five flex connectors on the motherboard. There's three. All right, there's all five. You don't need to pull up your camera. Uh, you can leave it there. You just want to grab the back of your board like this and just kind of lift that out at an angle like that okay so now that we have the board removed we'll zoom back in and show you the ear speaker ear speaker is right here in the middle uh, we've already replaced it so it's going to come out pretty easy just make sure your prongs are pointing towards the top of the phone uh, you're just, there's a little bit of adhesive underneath the speaker. It's going to be harder to get up um, the first time. You're just going to want to pry under there gently and remove it. Make sure that you're careful in this application. Uh, there is a flex cable underneath here that is shaped to fit that area. Uh, it has a hole in the middle. Uh, this is actually a ribbon flex cable that you don't want to rip right here. It has your earpiece sensor and some other functions as well. All right, so take your new speaker, drop it right in, prongs pointed the right way, uh, reverse this process, and you have an ear speaker replacement for the iPhone 4. If you guys have any questions, feel free to email us at sales at myibroke.com. We're always happy to troubleshoot any issues you guys may be having free of charge, uh, so take advantage of that if you need it. All right, thanks, guys. Have a great day.